the hell does this mean? She goes, just read it, moron. All right. So that's, what, that's what I was told for the intro. So please welcome all the way from OGB Mary. <laughs> class, right? <laughs> and uh, although I enjoy entertaining people and making everyone laugh, my main motivator is to find a man. <laughs> I figure it could happen one of two ways. I could either impress the shit out of somebody tonight, that everybody's gonna run to the dressing room door, or I'm gonna suck so bad that I'll get a pity date out of it. <laughs> either way, at this point in my life, as long as there's a penis attached, I'm gay. <laughs> So I've tried everything everybody says you should do to find a man, you know, they're like, meet a guy at work, at least you know he has a job. Like, yeah, that's cool, except that, uh, yeah, I work for a software company, yeah. yeah. The guys there, they either look like Dilbert or they're all married, or both. I don't look like Laura Croft, so you can cancel that, they're not even looking my way. I don't even know how to make my own character on World of Warlocks. <laughs> I have a better chance of my identity getting stolen at work than finding a date. Sure that. So then they're like, you know, all my friends are in serious relationships and they're married. They want me to be miserable too. So they're like, do the internet dating. Everyone's doing it. It's the new thing. And I'm like, yeah, set up my profile. <laughs> I'm not good at bragging about myself, right? So I got a couple friends, they set up a page for me, and I go out there and look, and like, every picture in my mouth is like, wide open. Like, I'm at my like, tenth surprise party, and, or I'm held up at gunpoint, one of the two. Just, and there's descriptions of me, right? They're like, I'm very caring and giving to the ones that I love. I'm great, uh, I love sports, so I'm great at handling balls. Uh, I'm not as dumb as I look. And I'm ex Navy, so I have a lot of experience with semen. <laughs> For the life of me, I can't figure out why they say I'm um, caring and giving to the ones I love. Like, what the fuck is that about? <laughs> so I'm like chatting with this dude online, right? I don't know how the hell with that profile set up, but I'm chatting with this guy, right? And the difference between their pictures and then meeting them in person, it can be quite staggering. You know, I'm sitting here chatting with this dude, and he's supposedly tall, dark, handsome, Rico Suave looking dude, right? And I'm like, anxious to meet him. I'm like, shit, we've been chatting for three hours, dude. What's up? It's me. Let me meet you, stranger. Yeah. But we gotta do it in public. There's more, you know, there's rules for this shit, you know? So I go to finally meet the guy, and I'm like walking up to, you know, the little mall area near the movie. Movies and I'm looking around, I'm like, I don't see Rico Suave. There you are. And then I finally, this guy's like, Jessica, Jessica. And I look up and it's my freaking co worker in a fucking cape. <laughs> thanks, thanks, but no thanks. So then that shit wasn't working for me, right? So then I was like, all right, I'm gonna take it back old school. Just go to the club, right? Get my little dance on. <laughs> Cracker clap. <laughs> so that shit wasn't working for me either. So I'm like, okay, I'll go to the grocery store, right? I'm fine, I'll go to the grocery store. So I take a nice Saturday afternoon to go stroll the local grocery store, and I walk into the store. I don't even bother with a basket or cart, because I could just fuck my walk up, you know? <laughs> and I'm in my latest and greatest bridesmaid's dress, because, you know, the bitch said I could wear it again. Might as well make you something. So I'm walking around, and I'm strolling to the produce section, you know, roll over to the cucumbers. Larger cucumbers, I hear they can be quite intimidating. <laughs> so I'm, you know, over at the cucumbers, I'm leaning. Check me out. All of a sudden, a freaking cucumber falls on the ground. I'm like, shit! Ooh, I can show off my ass. <laughs> so I bend over, pick up the cucumber, and there's this patent leather shoe just like tapping in front of me. And I look up, and it's another bitch in a bridesmaid's dress. <laughs> 
Then she starts trying to grab my perfectly shaped, less intimidating cucumber, and I'm like, oh, hell no. Put her in a headlock, give her a boogie. She drops it, I grab it, and run to express aisle, get the fuck out of there. Right? Always the bridesmaid, never the shopper. So, oh, 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 I think I see some dudes running to the dressing room. She's, she's waiting in the back. Serious. She, 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 she put a, uh, a little red light in, took all the bulbs out. It's a nice big man. Uh, I just picked the wrong name. Just, Come back up! Come back up! 